All right, Jeffy, I'm gonna throw the baseball and you're gonna hit it, okay? Jeffy, stop hitting yourself with the bat. Jeffy, stop it. All right, Jeffy, I'm gonna throw the ball and you're gonna hit it, okay? Oh, bitch, why would you throw that ball at me? Jeffy, you're supposed to hit it. Fuck you. Oh, Jeffy, look, when you play baseball, you throw a ball and you hit it with the bat, okay? So look, hit this ball with the bat when I throw it, okay? Uh, uh. I can't wait to get Mario's house payment. He's late. Ah! Jeffy, run inside, run inside, run inside. You've got to be fucking kidding me. What the fuck? Why are we running inside, Danny? I hit the ball. I know you hit the ball, Jeffy, but it, it hit Goodman's windshield and it cracked it, and now he's gonna come here to kill us. Oh, okay, what are we gonna do? We gotta think, we gotta think fast. Uh, okay, I'm gonna lie. I'm gonna say it wasn't us. Uh, uh, Jeffy, I need you to go upstairs and pretend to be asleep. Well, I'm not tired, Danny. Pretend to be asleep, damn it! Fine, you can say please next time, asshole! Okay, okay, he'll be here any second. Uh, 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 let me get ready, let me get ready. Uh, hello? Is this your fucking baseball? Uh, no, no, well, why would that be my baseball? No, I don't even own a baseball. Why, why would you even ask me if that's my baseball? That's, that's weird. Well, the weirdest thing happened, Mario. I was in your neighborhood coming to your house to get your house payment, and I looked up to check the weather, and I was like, holy shit. The weatherman lied to me. He said it was supposed to be sunny, but it wasn't. It was cloudy with a chance of fucking baseball. And this baseball? Landed and cracked my windshield. Well, it, Fuck me, right? Well, it, it, it cracked your windshield? Oh, oh yeah. Oh my, I'm so sorry. That's, I don't know who would do that. It must be some hoodlum kids or something doing that. I, I don't know. Well, are you sure it wasn't you and your son? My son, Jeffy? Jeffy would never do that. Jeffy doesn't even own a baseball. Oh, that's really fucking weird because it says Jeffy's favorite ball on it. That... That, that, that is weird. Why, why would it say that? I, you know what? I, I think we're framed. I think the neighbor is trying to frame us, and, and they wrote that on the baseball and then cracked the windshield. Framed? Yeah, framed. Well, frame a picture of my stretched out ass, Mario. Well, uh, well uh, it, it, wasn't, it wasn't us, I promise. I, I, I swear. You, you didn't even ask my son, but he, he, he's, he's sleeping. Well, I'm going to wake him up. I'm waking him up. I'm going to ask him, Jeffy, wake up! All right, Goodman, you want to see my son, Jeffy? Well, look, here he is, sleeping with his baseball bat. Does that say Jeffy's favorite bat? Yeah. And this says Jeffy's favorite ball? Oh, come on! Don't you think these two items are related, Mario? No, 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 no. I, I think it's a coincidence, you know? I, I think we're being framed still by the neighbor. Well, damn. The trail's gone cold. How am I going to solve this case of whose fucking ball this is? Well, it, it's not ours. It's, it's not ours. You don't think Jeffy used his favorite bat to hit his favorite ball? Which hit my favorite windshield? What? Jimmy! Jimmy, why, why would you do that? You talked about Jimmy! Oh my god! You talked about Jimmy! Oh my god, I gotta, I gotta call a doctor! I have to call a doctor! Hey, you called the doctor? Yeah, thanks for coming. See, my friend here is knocked unconscious and I wanna know if he's dead or not. Alright, I'll take a look. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm, yeah. Well, well, he's dead? Oh no, he shampoos and conditions. His hair is really soft. But, but is he dead or not? Um, no, no. Uh, he does have a really big bump on his head, though. What happened to him? Oh, well, uh, he bumped his head from, uh, uh jumping on the bed. Yeah, jumping on the bed. <sighs> now, I said no more monkeys jumping on the bed. I was very clear about that. I know, but he couldn't help himself, you know? <sighs> <sighs> He's alive? Where am I? What's my name? Who, who, who are you guys? He, he, he can't remember anything. I guess he has amnesia from the bump on his head. Amnesia, uh... Your name is Mr. Goodman. Mr. Goodman? Yeah, and the reason you were here is because uh, you were going to give each of us a couple million dollars. Yep, a couple million dollars. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, millions of dollars, yep. A couple million dollars? Yeah, each. Yeah, you said you were going to give it to us, like right now. Nice try, asshole. I remember everything. You hit me in the head with a baseball bat. What? No, I, I didn't hit you in the head with a baseball bat. That was Jeffy. I, I did not do that. No, it was an accident. It was a complete accident. <gasps> Why can't I feel my legs? Why can't I move my arms? I, I can't move any of my muscles in my body. Wait, wait what? I can't move. Wait, 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 why can't he move, doctor? I guess getting hit on the head caused him to be paralyzed from the neck down. Wait, are, are you just joking with us? I'm not joking, Mario. I can't move a muscle. You, you, you can't move? No. Well, that's not good. So can't, can't you fix it? Uh, no, there's no fix for paralysis. Well, you, you, can't, you don't have like medicine or something? No, there's no medicine for this kind of thing. Okay, so what do we do? Well, somebody has to take care of him. Well, take care of him? Uh, yeah, and because you caused this, it has to be you. What, me? Yeah, you. That's right, Mario. You get over here and you wipe my ass. What? 
I'm not, I'm not doing that. No, you, you're a doctor. Why don't, why don't you do it? You, you deal with gross stuff all the time. <laughs> I'm not a doctor. Do you see this shirt? I got this at a Halloween store. What? Mario, my ass needs wiping. What, what, but you, come on, you, you, you can move. Look, look, you can, you, you can, you can move. Oh, oh, come on. Nope. Oh, oh come on. Look, you're not really paralyzed. Like your leg is, it's, it's. Uh... I'm like a spaghetti noodle, Mario. Uh, uh, oh, okay, fi fine. I'll wipe you. But are you, did you even have an accident? Yep. Wet and floppy. Spaghetti noodle. <sighs> <sighs> Alright, Goodman. I put a diaper on you in case you have another accident. Oh, it wasn't an accident, Mario. Oh, well, in case you poop again, uh, just say, uh, I made a messy so I'll know when you poop. Okay. Hey, Mario! What? I just took a shit. Right in my diaper. Uh, right, right in your diaper? Oh, yeah. A big rhinoceros shit. Uh, uh, okay, well, anyway, is there anything you need? Is there anything I can get you? Yeah! My diaper changed. But I just put one on you. You can't just, I mean, you know, you can't even feel it, right? So why don't you just sit there in it, you know? Rhinoceros shit. <sighs> Fine, I'll, I'll change it. <sighs> okay, Goodman, I just changed your diaper. Is there anything else you need? Yeah, I'm actually really hungry, Mario. Uh, okay, you're hungry? Uh, what do you want? A filet mignon. A filet mignon? You mean like the steak? Yeah, medium rare, peppercorned, with blue cheese crumbles and a side of caviar. Caviar? Where am I going to find caviar at? I don't know where to get that. I don't know, Mario, but you better find it because I'm paralyzed because of you. Okay, fine. I'll find a way to get it. Is there anything else you want? Yeah, one more thing, Mario. Can you hand me the remote control? What? Hand you the remote? It, it's right here. I'm paralyzed, Mario. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Oh, okay, so how are we going to do this? Where do you want it? Just put it in my mouth. Oh. That's what she said. Wow. Wow, Mario, just wow. A grown man is on your couch in a diaper because you paralyzed him, and at this horrific moment of my life, you're gonna sit there and make a that's what she said joke? Wow, I'm appalled. I'm appalled that you would make that sort of joke, Mario. Uh, I'm sorry, I, I didn't know it was gonna hurt that bad. That's what she said. <sighs> oh, here. <sighs> Okay, Goodman's steak is almost done. Hey, dang, look at my pee-pee. Je Jeffy, that's not a pee-pee, that's a squash. What is a squash? It's a vegetable, Jeffy. Oh, like the guy upstairs? No, Jeffy, it's a vegetable. Just put put it back, put it wherever you found it. Okay, do you want me to squash it? No, it's, it's, it's called a squash. I don't want you to squash it. I'm working on a steak, Jeffy, just don't don't bother me. Okay, guy. Okay, I, I, think, I think it's almost done. You want it medium rare? Squash! <laughs> Don't squash it! Get out of here with that! Get out of here with that! Don't, don't get in the steak! It's done anyway. <sighs> All right, Goodman, I got your dinner right here. I got your filet mignon, medium rare with peppercorns. I got your caviar, and I didn't have any blue cheese, so I got you American cheese. Oh, I didn't know we were playing hockey, Mario. What, hockey? Yeah, that damn hockey puck on my plate covered in roly polies. Oh, no, 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 that, that's your filet mignon. It's medium rare. Uh huh, my ass. And what about this cat throw up? Oh, no, no, that, that's your caviar. Uh-huh, sure. And there's still plastic on the cheese I didn't ask for. Oh, plastic? Oh, yeah, I'll take it off right now. No, 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 I'm not going to eat that, Mario. What? You want, you want to know what I want you to do? What? I want you to take this butter knife down here and just castrate me, because I would enjoy that a lot more than eating this dinner. Go ahead. I'm ready for my neuter. Oh, okay, what do you want me to do, Goodman? You want me to recook everything? I can recook everything. No, Mario, I've completely lost my appetite, but I'm beginning to work up a shit. So change me. Change you again? Yes, change me. <sighs> <sighs> All right, Jeffy, we're gonna get Mr. Goodman a bath, but he's paralyzed from the neck down, so he can't keep his head up. So I need you to keep his head up so he doesn't drown, okay? Okay, guy. All right, uh, keep his head up, don't let go of it. I'm gonna go get a shampoo, okay? <sighs> All right, I got the shampoo. Oh my god! Hey, Danny, look, I found a pumpkin with a pee pee on it. Jimmy, that's not a pumpkin, that, that's a squash! No, Danny, the pee pee back there was a squash. There's a pumpkin with a pee pee. Look, Jimmy, that's a squash. Give us a good man out of the bathroom, he's drowning. I don't know how to swim, Danny! Save him, Jimmy! Oh, Danny, look! 
Goodman, I'm so sorry my son almost let you drown. Mario, you are the worst caretaker I've ever seen. Well, no, don't say that. I'm trying. I really am trying. Well, you're not trying hard enough. Well, yeah, I am. I cooked you dinner. I gave you a bath. I've changed your diaper like 5,000 times. Mario, a deaf-blind, dumb person can do a better job than you're doing. You know what, Goodman? You are the meanest person ever. You know what? You deserve to be paralyzed from the neck down because you're mean and you're greedy and, and this is karma for everything you've ever done to anybody else in the world. You take that back right now, Mario. No, 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 no. You deserve all this to happen to you, Goodman. You really do deserve it. And you know what? I don't have to make a house payment this month. I don't have to make a house payment ever again because you're paralyzed, so you can't make me. Yeah, you still have to pay your house payment, Mario. No, I don't. And look, you know what? I'm gonna go drive your Lamborghini because you're paralyzed from the neck down, so you can't stop me. That's it. I've had enough of this. What? Stop. No, no, stop right there, Mario. You're what? not taking my Lamborghini. What? How are you moving? It's a big fucking miracle, Mario. I was faking it the whole time. What? Faking it? Yeah, because you inconvenienced me by breaking my windshield, so I was going to inconvenience you by making you my servant for two weeks. What, two weeks? Yep, two fucking weeks, Mario. But I couldn't keep that shit going because you were just screwing everything up. Uh, well, so you were just faking it? Yep, you gave me cat throw up, a hockey puck for steak, and what the, what the hell was that? Cheese? That was plastic cheese. So you were literally just faking all that, just to just make me your servant. Yep, but I couldn't keep it going anymore, Mario. I held my breath for five damn minutes underneath that bathtub while your kid played with a pumpkin. So Mario, I'll be back tomorrow for your house payment. Have a good night. All right, Ras. Ras mouth problem for today. Ching Chong wants to buy egg rolls. And each egg roll costs three dollars. Ching Chong already has two dollars and a dollar. How many egg rolls can he buy? Well, Ching Chong only has two dollars, so he can't afford to buy an egg roll. But Ching Chong has a dollar. So how much is a dollar worth in China, Crass? One dollar. Correct. So two dollars plus one dollar equals three dollars. So Ching Chong can buy one egg roll. It's very important for you to remember this, class for your test next week. So go home, do your homework, and I'll see you tomorrow. Oh, we have homework tonight? Jeffy, are you doing the homework tonight? Hold on, Junior. I'm picking ass boogers right now, and I think I got a good one. Oh, I think I got something stuck underneath my fingernail. Can I smell it? Oh, hell! Yeah, hit that ass booger. Uh, oh, oh, that's a dang ass booger. Oh, Junior, you should hit that. Oh, guys, I'm just really worried about the homework tonight. Junior, you want to know why I say that homework? What? I say fuck that homework. You guys DTF? Yeah. Down to Fortnite? I'm talking pounding ass pickles, Junior. I'm talking when we get home, we squat up and we spur lump some buttholes. That, I mean, that does sound fun. I mean, who needs to do homework? Exactly, Junior. Let's go fuck some people up. Let's go do it. Just had a long, boring day at school. Can't wait to sit down and play Fortnite all night long. Jeffy, before you play video games, you have to do your homework. I don't have to. Jeffy, yes, you do. You have to do your homework before you play video games. Where's the contract at, Daddy? What contract? Exactly. I didn't sign a contract that said I can't play video games until my homework's done. Well, we don't have a contract, Jeffy. We don't need one. Exactly, Daddy. So I'm going to play video games all night long. No, no, Jeffy, no, no. You have to do your homework first. Daddy, do you not know? How hard it is to go to school for eight hours a day and not pay attention to people talking at you and assigning you work that I'm not going to do. And then they want to say, oh, here's homework. Go home and do more nothing. I'm not doing my homework, daddy. And I'm going to sit right here and play my video games all night long. You know what, Jeffy? I'm going to go take a dump because I really have to take a dump. And after my dump, you better be ready to do your homework. Great. Who's that? I hope it's a pizza man. I didn't order pizza, but I can hope, right? Maybe you got the wrong house. Pizza man? No, no, I'm actually off the clock right now. Uh, is Mario here? Yeah, he's just taking a big fat patty whacker dump. Oh, that well, sounds like I caught him at a bad time. Uh, this is your grandpa. He's getting kicked out of the retirement home because he grabbed one of the nurse's butts. Yeah, Veronica was pretty upset about it. So, uh, he's your problem now. I'm just gonna limbo out of here. How low can I go? Grandpa? Rufus? Yeah! Rufus! Oh, I have a good idea. Come inside. Okay. 
All right, Grandpa, you're gonna sit right here and pretend to be me while I go play video games all night, all right? Yeah, you kids these days with your tinker toys and your calculators and rocking horses, I don't understand it. All right, well, I'm gonna I'm go. All right, guys, I'm in my closet. You guys ready to squat up? I'm gonna play Fortnite all night long. I'm not even going to school tomorrow. I'm alone. All right, Jeffy. We're gonna do your math homework, okay? Ah, pooped. Oh, okay. Well, you always poop, Jeffy. So we're gonna do your math homework, okay? Uh, Rufus. What? No math homework. Okay, Rufus. All right. So, uh, first question: Ping Pong has two balls. He hits one ball with paddle. How much pain is he in? No, oh, my balls are saggy and stretched out like an old sock. No, the answer would be a lot. He's in a lot of pain. Oh. Yeah. So, uh, question number two. Some dumb hoe has three sisters. They go to the nail salon to get toes done. They paint four toes and quits because of ingrown toenail. How many toe no paint? Feet! No, the, the answer is six. Uh oh. Yeah, they only painted four toes and they stopped. So, there's, there's six no paint, okay? Oh, okay. Yeah, so uh, number three. Slung Lek Dong had 14 cats and four cucumber. He ate four of them. Four of what did he eat? Kitty! Yes, correct. Four cats. Yeah, I eat kitty. <laughs> yeah, that. So, uh, okay, number four. Chickity China, the Chinese chicken, lays eight eggs. It takes 20 eggs to make egg drop soup. How many eggs have dropped in the soup? Mm, I like soup. Mm, soup is good. Yeah, but how many eggs have dropped? Uh, 20? No, no, not 20. Only eight, because the, the chicken only laid eight eggs. He can't drop 20, he only has eight. Oh. Yeah, all right, so the last question is, girl in hospital says, something wrong with Verina after she had four baby. What wrong with Verina? Oh, Veronica! Oh, I like Veronica, she had a nice egg. And not Veronica, Verina. Um, Very loose. No, no, her ass was really tight. Okay, okay, well look, Jeffy, look, we, we're finished with your homework, I just helped you with it, so let's go get you some dinner so you can go to bed, so you can go to school tomorrow, okay? Okay, Rufus. Alright, let's go. Mm. Alright, Jeffy, here's your SpaghettiOs. Mm. You poisoned these, did you? No, Jeffy, why would I poison your SpaghettiOs? Uh, you're not in my will. I gave it all to Lugie. He's taller, I'm green, he's got a mansion. You a doctor? No. No, I didn't think so. Jeffy, Jeffy, just eat. Uh, you, you hide my pills in baloney. I don't want to see them. You don't take pills, Jeffy. Just eat your stupid spaghettios. <laughs> you smell like throw up. Oh, uh, oh, Jeffy, they're spaghettios. You've eaten cold spaghettios before. Cold? You didn't eat these up? No, you like them cold. No, it's quite all right. I don't think I want those. I'd rather just die in my sleep. So you're saying you want to go to bed? Yup. And you don't want to eat anything before you, go, before you go to bed? No. All right, let's go to bed. Rufus! What? Huh? Let's go to bed, Jeffy. Okay, Rufus. All right, Jeffy, it's time to go to bed. Anal. Is there anything you want before you go to bed? Metamucil. I need my Metamucil. Uh, okay, well, you never take that ever, Jeffy, so you don't need it. I think I'm having a stroke. My arm doesn't work. I can't move it. Je Jeffy, you're just playing around, okay? So I'll wake you up in the morning to go to school, okay? Good night. Good night, Rufus. <sighs> Nazis. Jeffy, it's time to go to school. Gunfire, quick, hit the deck! Jeffy, stop playing, it's time to go to school. I stepped on a landmine. There goes my leg! Bye, leg. Well, Je Jeffy, it's time to go to school, wake up. Oh, you are sexy and nice, ain't you? Mm, pull my catheter out with your teeth. Yeah, slow like. Jeffy, it's time to go to school! <laughs> oh, God, I'm blind! I'm blind! They did it! They finally did it! Those goddamn terrorists took my eyes! Jeffy, just open your eyes! No, I can't! I'm blind! Open your eyes! <laughs> there you go! Oh, it's a miracle! I can see! Are you Jesus? No, Jeffy, look, you have to go to school, okay? I'm not going to no concentration camp! Uh what? Uh, Jeffy, look, you just have to go to school. Uh, 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 they got they got macaroni. All right, class. I hope you all enjoy your F. Anyway, as I was saying, the history lesson for today is Pearl Harbor. Everyone think Pearl Harbor was attacked, but it wasn't. It was actually a big misunderstanding. Us Japanese just really wanted to go to Hawaii for vacation. So this is what happened. See, Japan right here. And Hawaii is way the fuck over here in the middle of the goddamn ocean. And what happened, Crash, was that our planes ran out of gas and we crashed into your ship. 
and we don't know how many times we have to say this. We sorry. Why you think buffet so cheap? If we try to apologize, we keep apologizing. We get rid of your straight cat, your straight dog. We 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 help it. You kamikaze sons of bitches! I'll show you a kamikaze. <laughs> I, I think I broke my hip. Jeffy, go back to your desk. Uh, how about I drop two more nukes on your Asian ass? How about that? Jeffy, go back to your desk or else you're gonna be suspended. Uh, Cody, I don't think that's Jeffy. No. Uh, you can't take my freedom. One more word out of you, Jeffy, and you're suspended. Oh yeah, I got one more word for you. Carrots. Wow, Jeffy, unbelievable. You got suspended for saying carrots? Yep, and I'd say it again, too. I fought for this country and I earned the right to yell carrots at the Chinese. Well, you know what, Jeffy? If you want to be all big and bad and talk back to your teacher, then you're grounded. Ooh, 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 I pooped. What? Uh, I pooped. Well, you know what, Jeffy? You said you pooped your diaper again, you can just sit in it. Mm, 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 squishy. All right, well, you know what, Jeffy? I'm not going to let you just sit around since you're grounded. I want you to go take out the trash. Huh? I want you to go take out the trash. What? I want you to go take out the trash. God damn it, where's my hearing aid? You don't need a hearing aid, Jeffy. You have two ears. Look, go take out the trash right now. I'm fucking leaving. I'm a war veteran. I don't have to take this. I get no goddamn respect in this house. I lost my teeth for this country. I deserve to be treated better. What, what kind of Nazi trap is this? Murphy, the Nazis done took over your house and dug a hole in the living room. Ugh. That's fine, I can jump it. I earn the Medal of Honor! What? What was that noise? Jeffy? Jeffy, are you okay? Hey there, what seems to be the problem? Oh, thank God you're here, Doctor. My son fell on the stairs and now he's not breathing. Is he okay? That's an 80-year-old man. What? No, it's not. That's my son! No, that's, that's an old man. What? No, that's my son, Jeffy. Look, his shirt says Jeffy. He has a gray mustache. What? Uh, uh, oh yeah, well, uh, uh, Jeffy has a mustache. What? No, he doesn't. That's an old man. Wait, uh, oh yeah, wait, that's my grandpa! That's your grandpa? Oh yeah, I'm sorry, I just got it confused because he was wearing my son's clothes. Oh, just because somebody changes their clothes, they turn into a completely different person. I mean, you know I'm the cop, right? What? You're the cop? Yes, I change clothes depending on what job I'm doing. You didn't know that this whole time? What? No, I'm, I'm sorry, it's just people look different when they change their clothes, you know? I is that why you wear the same clothes every day? So you don't forget who you are? What? No, it's just, look, 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 look. He was wearing my son's clothes, so I thought he was my son. I'll be right back. Oh, Grandpa, I'm so sorry. I didn't know it was you. What? Hey, Daddy. Jeffy, thank God you're okay. I thought you were hurt. Your Grandpa's not looking too good, though. Are you fucking serious? Jeffy, don't cuss. It's me, the Brooklyn guy. I was a doctor just one second ago. But, but your shirt says Jeffy. Yeah, and my helmet's the wrong color, too. But you don't see anything above the neck, so I guess it makes sense that you wouldn't recognize me. But, but, but you have a shirt that says Jeffy. You're wearing Jeffy's clothes. There was something wrong with you, okay? There's something wrong with your eyes. You need eye surgery. That's the next video. Mario gets eye surgery. Well, okay, well, then, look. He's wearing Jeffy's clothes. You're wearing Jeffy's clothes. Who's Jeffy? Did you get hit in the head or something? Hey, daddy. Can we have pizza rolls for dinner? or bagel bites or some shit. Anything pizza related I'm down for. What? Who are you? Who's this guy with no shirt on in my house? Get out of here. That's your son. What? That is not my son. He does not have a shirt on that says Jeffy. That's still your son. Oh, okay, look, I don't have three sons. Look, there's Jeffy, you're Jeffy, he's Jeffy. Who's the real Jeffy? You know what, me. I, I'm the real Jeffy. I knew it. I, I knew you were the real Jeffy, Jeffy. Yeah, okay, great. Let's go eat some pizza rolls or something. Yeah, and you two, get out of my house. I, I know there's only one Jeffy. Um, so am I a doctor now? Ugh, here, knock yourself out. Yay! Hey, Danny, why can't I see anything? Am I blind? No, Jeff, you're not blind. I put a blindfold on you because I got you a birthday surprise. Birthday surprise? Yeah, a birthday surprise. All right, Jeff, I'm going to open your eyes. Happy birthday! Holy horse testicles, Danny! You got me a bouncy house? Yep, Jeffy, I got you a bounce house. Are you kidding me, Danny? No, no, go jump in it, Jeffy, go jump in it. Yay! Oh, Mario, he's so happy. Yeah, I knew he'd love it. It just took forever to get this thing inside the house. Where'd you get it from? I got it from Toys R Us. Oh, well, you know what else is today, Mario? What? The solar eclipse. What, a solar eclipse? Yeah, it's when the moon blocks out the sun. What? Oh, Jeffy, oh, Jeffy, oh, no. Oh, Jeffy, Jeffy. Daddy. 
Why? Why did the house pop? I don't know, Jeffy. I guess it's just cheap. But, but don't worry. I got you another surprise. Another surprise? Yeah, come on, Jeffy. Follow me. All right, Jeffy. It's time for your second surprise. Hey, um, Dad, why can't I see anything again? And why am I holding a bat? Because, Jeffy, you're going to hit a pinata with that bat. What's your pinata? Uh, it's a, it's a horsey full of candy. A horsey full of candy? Oh! I see a horsey full of candy. Well, you can't see it, Jeffy. You have to have your blindfold on. Why? Because you're supposed to hit the horse with your bat. Why are you doing? Because you're supposed to beat the horse until all the candy comes out. <laughs> okay, dang. But how am I going to hit the horsey if I can't see it? Well, that's the part of the game. You're not supposed to see it. You're supposed to just run up there and just swing your bat and hope you hit it. And I won't get in trouble? Nope, you won't get in trouble. Just swing at it. Well, all right, dang. <laughs> He just did what you told him to do. Oh, I know, I know. Just, just, just take him into the kitchen. I'm gonna, I'm gonna ask Jeffy how his birthday cake's doing. Just give, give me that back. Come on, Jeffy. <sighs> After so many hours, this cake is finally done. Hey, Chef Beaver, are you done with Jeffy's birthday cake yet? Yeah, Mario is right here. But, wow, that looks just like a Cheerio box. Thank you, but one question. Why did you have me make a Cheerio box cake? Well, because Jeffy really likes Cheerios, so he wanted a Cheerio cake. Oh, well get your stupid cake. I gotta clean up the kitchen. Alright, thank you so much, Chef Pee. Mm -hmm. oh, he's gonna love this. <clears throat> Alright, Jeffy, here's your birthday cake. <gasps> my birthday cake is Cheerio Box Day? Yeah, it's a Cheerio box. Can I stick my pee-pee in it? Uh, no, Jeffy, it's a birthday cake. Here, stick your pee-pee in it. Oh, wait, wait, where's Rosalina? I don't even know. Oh, hold on, Jeffy, I'll be right back. She has, she has to be here for this. What, baby, what are you doing? The solar eclipse is about to happen, Mario. Well, Jeffy needs to blow out his birthday candles. Oh, well, let's hurry. I don't want to miss this. Okay, we'll hurry, we'll hurry. Oh. All right, let's sing happy birthday to Jeffy. Oh, <gasps> Jeffy! Oh, 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 Jeffy! Oh, Jeffy, stop it! <laughs> Jeffy, what are you doing? How are we doing the Cheerio box, Mom? Pee pee. Oh, Jeffy, now we can't eat cake because your pee pee was in it. Hurry and make a wish, Jeffy. The solar eclipse is happening right now. A wish? What do I wish for? Well, Jeffy, it's your birthday. You can wish for whatever you want. So blow out the candles and wish for whatever you want. Whatever I want? Hmm. <gasps> the solar eclipse is happening right now! Jeffy, hurry and make a wish! Uh, uh, I wish today would last forever. <laughs> Yay, Jeffy, you made your wish! Happy birthday! Happy birthday! You want a piece of your cake, Jeffy? J Jeffy? What? Jeffy! Come on, Mario, let's go outside and watch the solar eclipse before it's over! Uh, 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 come on, Jeffy, I'll yell at you later. <sighs> Whoa. Whoa! It's a total solar eclipse, Mario! It looks so amazing! It looks like a butthole, Daddy. Well, well how long does it usually last? About a minute. Oh, so let's enjoy this minute. Uh, I thought you said this only lasts a minute. It does, but it's been like 10 minutes. What's going on? Um, Danny, what would happen if that butthole started pooping? That'd be some big poops. Um, I think we should go turn on the news and find out what's going on. Breaking news, Mikai! The solar eclipse just won't stop. NASA's holding an emergency press conference. Let's go to that. Uh, hello there. I am Space Cadet Brooklyn T. Guy. I'm with NASA. Uh, we called this emergency press conference here today because the solar eclipse that was supposed to happen today is still going on. Uh, it was only supposed to last a minute. It, uh, it, it has now lasted 15 minutes and the moon has not moved. So we're a little scared. But, uh, we're, we're gonna wait for another five minutes before we, before we really start freaking out. Oh no, Mario! The moon isn't moving! Wait, why is it doing that? What's happening? Are we gonna die? Are we gonna no, die? No, no, calm down. Everything will probably be okay. We should just wait the five minutes like the astronaut said. Oh, oh, okay, we'll just, we'll just wait the five minutes, I guess. Dang, did the butthole in the sky do something bad? Oh, we, we don't know yet, Jeffy. Bad butthole, bad! You better stop what you're doing right now before I come up there and lick it. Yeah, yeah, so so the moon has still not moved. It's it's still blocking the sun. Uh it would it would be really nice if the moon would, would please move. Please, please move. Uh sunlight is crucial for uh humans and plant life on Earth, and uh without sunlight we could all die. But uh we, we are working on a solution to this problem to try to fix this situation, but uh we could all die. <laughs> We're gonna die! We're gonna die! Mario, Mario, stop freaking out! You're gonna scare Jeffy on his birthday! He doesn't even understand what's going on! Listen here, Mr. Butthole! You're scaring my daddy! Do you better stop him right now! 
Hey, Daddy, um, how do you wipe your butt if you're scared of buttholes? I'm not scared of buttholes, Jimmy. Okay, okay. so we got some good news. Uh, no, before you ask, the, the moon has not moved out of the way of the sun, but we do have some solutions on how we can move the moon out of the way of the sun. Okay, so first we're gonna try scaring the moon so it runs away. All right, I'll be right back. Okay, I'm gonna sneak up and scare the moon. Boom! Did, did it work? Are you scared? Well, that didn't work. That is one fearless moon. But don't panic, we got more ideas. Uh, next, we're gonna try to wrap a bunch of rope around the moon and tow it away. Uh, I, I'm gonna need a lot more rope than this, about 35 million feet of rope. But I, I think I know a guy, just, I'll be right back. Okay, so I got the rope tied around the moon. Uh, luckily, I had a friend that owns a rope store and just had stockpiles of rope sitting around. So yeah, let's move this moon. Oh, come on, you bastard, move! All right, let me kick it into maximum overdrive. Damn it, the rope broke. That's it, the moon is really starting to piss me off. All right, so we have no other choice. We're gonna have to, we're gonna have to nuke the moon. But I mean, I mean, come on, what has the moon ever done for us, right? All right, let's nuke that moon. Yeah, take that moon! Yeah, take that, you bitch! Ah, uh, ah, uh, man. <sighs> All right, the nuke didn't work. It just made more craters on the moon, so we've done everything we can to move the moon, so it looks like we're just gonna have to accept it. Uh, we've decided to put Christmas lights all over the moon to try to lighten it up and get some of that sunlight back. I'll be right back. Ah, <sighs> well that's just tacky. We oh great, one went out, now the whole thing went out, and now I gotta find which one went out and replace it, but there's over seven trillion lights up there, it's gonna take forever! I'm not doing that! All right, guys, so we've tried everything in our power to fix this moon problem, and it's not working, so it looks like this is the end of humanity. Uh, if anybody at home knows how we could fix this problem, please let us know, because we are stumped. I don't want to die, Mario! Me either, baby! <laughs> <laughs> Mommy, Daddy, what, Jeppy? I got puffy balls on my cone hat. I wish today would go back to normal! Me too! <laughs> I wish I could help, Daddy, but I already used my birthday wish. What? Jeffy. What? You wished for your birthday wish that today would never end, right? Yeah. Baby, what if his wish came true? He made that wish during the solar eclipse, and then everything uh, like stood still. So what if his birthday wish came true? Oh, don't be ridiculous, Mario. You want to know what's ridiculous, Mommy? Puffy balls on my cone hat. I'm gonna call NASA! That has to be it! I'm gonna call NASA! Uh, hello? Hey, it's me from NASA. I came as soon as you called. We really need suggestions for how to move that moon. And please tell me your suggestion is not to eat it. The moon is not made out of cheese. People keep thinking that. Oh, no, 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 it's not that. Oh, come on, it's something important. All right. All right, what's going on here? Well, today's my son's birthday. Oh, clearly, look at that puffy bald cone hat! Thanks. Well, anyway, my son made a birthday wish, and he wished during the solar eclipse that today would never end. What? Oh my god, he did what? what what's wrong? Well, everybody knows you get one wish every year on your birthday, and it always comes true. Well, I didn't know that. Well, yeah, usually people use it on, like, a bike or a new toy or something stupid. Not, not that. Do we see a ball or not? What, what do we do then? I don't know. This is crazy. I, I don't know how to reverse a wish. Yeah, I don't even know what to do. Well, Mario, if a person gets one wish on their birthday every year, why don't we find someone else whose birthday is today and have them wish everything was back to normal? I'm the astronaut here. I come up with the solutions, okay? Yeah, he's the astronaut, baby. Hmm. Oh, I got it. What? I got it. How about if we find somebody else whose birthday is today and we make them wish that everything was back to normal? What? That's genius! That's, that's not genius, baby! Yeah. Yeah, yeah, see, that's why I'm the astronaut. Yeah, he's the astronaut. Okay, okay, so so who else has a birthday today? Well, see, we gotta find somebody whose birthday's on the same day, so I'll go check the database. All right, I wonder whose birthday's today. Uh, him? Yeah, he's the only other person we could find that had a birthday today. Well, what do we do? Well, you should wake him up. Well, me? Why me? Look, I'm not good with homeless people, okay? You, you wake him up, I'll go make him a birthday cake. You tell him it's his birthday. Uh, 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 okay. <laughs> hey, hey. Uh, cheeseburger man. Yep, that's that's me. Cheeseburger man. Yep, that that's me. Um, well, uh, is is today your birthday? Mm-hmm. 
is today your birthday. Uh, birthday cake. Uh, I like I like birthday cake. Wait, you like birthday cake? Uh huh. Oh well, I, I have one at my house for you if you want it. Oh, okay. birthday cake, man. But yeah, yeah. yeah. Just, just follow me. Oh, beer though. What? Beer. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh, beer. You, you want beer? Uh-huh. Uh, okay, fine. I'll get you some beer. Oh, yeah. Oh, mm -hmm. <sighs> All right. I got him. You like my moon cake? What? Moon cake? Yeah, it looks just like the moon, right? It looks like a round cake with white icing on it. Well, okay, I don't see your cake. You try making a cake during the end of the world. Anyway, look, I got him. What do we need to do now? Well, now all we need him to do is wish for everything to go back to normal. Oh, uh, okay. All right, I'll get the candle. All right, get in front of the cake. Uh, All right, so uh, we made you a birthday cake, okay? Birthday cake. Birthday cake's great. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. so we, we made you a birthday cake. So what we need you to do is we need you to blow out this candle, and we need you to make a wish, and we need you to wish for the whole world to go back to normal, okay? Uh-huh. Yeah, okay, so happy birthday to you. Birthday man. Birthday man. Yeah, yeah, so uh, make, make your wish. I wish I had some beer. What? <laughs> I guess that's the end of the world. Oh, really? The end of the world? Yeah, I mean, unless you know somebody else whose birthday is today. I mean, I don't. No, I, I don't know anyone that's birthday's today. I mean, there's gotta be someone else who has a birthday today. I mean, yeah, as many people as there are in the world, you would think at least... Wait, what? Happy birthday, honey. Wait, what? Wait, what's today? T today, Today's the 21st. What? What? Well, it's my birthday today! What? what? Yeah, yeah, I work so much, I just, I rarely celebrate it. I forgot it was my birthday. What? Today's your birthday? Yeah! <laughs> Isn't that just the easiest fucking ending we could have thought of? Wait, wait, really? really? So, so you can wish that the world was back to normal? Yeah, let's light this candle! Okay! Well, happy birthday to me! Alright, so the candle's lit, uh, just blow it out and make that wish. Ahem. What? This song? What song? The birthday song! Sing me happy birthday! Well, we don't have time for that! Well, it's my birthday, alright? I haven't celebrated my birthday in 25 years. You better get to sing it. Okay, fine. Uh, happy birthday to I, you. I, 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 put some soul into it, man. Come on, for real. Okay, fine. Happy birthday to you. Good. Happy birthday Ooh. to you. To you. To me. Happy birthday to Brooklyn guy. Name, yep. Happy birthday to one, one note at the end. To you. Yeah. Bam. That's good. All right. Let's blow out this candle. I wish everything was back to normal. Uh, oh. Uh, oh. Uh, oh. Uh, uh, yeah. 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 Well, we're blind. We shouldn't have looked at the solar eclipse without special glasses, Mario! Hey, um, Danny, why can't I see anything again? Am I blind? Yes, Jeffy, now you're actually blind. Aww. All right, everybody, so it looks like everything's back to normal, the moon is moving, the birds are chirping, looks like everything's good! Uh, we do have a global shortage of rope in Christmas lights, though, so, uh, everybody pitch in and maybe we can do something about that. Oh man, I'm almost done decorating the Christmas tree. I just have to get the star on top. I'm just not tall enough. Hey, hey Mario, what's up, folk? <sighs> what do you want, Black Yoshi? Mario, I just be got done making my Christmas lisp. What, Christmas lisp? You mean Christmas list? Yeah, that's what I said, folk. This is everything I be wanting for some Christmas. See, I got me some KFC chickens on there. I got some poopish Kool-Aids. I got some college dudes. The Matt Packs. Some monies. Some more monies. 24-inch rims. And some LeBron Jordan shoes. All right, Black Yoshi, well, it's Christmas Eve, so there's no way I can go shopping and get you all that stuff. All the stores are closed. And also, I already got everyone their Christmas gifts. Oh, you already got me my Christmas gifts? Oh, man, for what'd you get me? So I'll go ahead and mark it off the lisp. Uh, I got you, uh... Uh, this ornament, right here, that, that ornament right there. Ooh, orphans, 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 uh, no, folks, that, that's not on my list, I ain't want me no some orphans. Well, Black Yoshi, that's what I got you, so if you want anything else, you just got to wait and see what Santa Claus brings you tonight. Santa Claus? Man, Santa Claus ain't gonna bring me nothing. Well, you have to see what Santa Claus brings you, that's, that's all you have to wait for. But what about my lisp? Uh, I'll, I'll call you an appointment next week to get your list fixed, okay? Uh, maybe Jeffy's tall enough to, tall enough to put the star on the tree. Uh, I'll, I'll get Jeffy. Hmm. Jeffy, come here! What do you want, Matty? All right, Jeffy, I think you're tall enough to put this star on top of the Christmas tree. And I think you're high if you think I can reach up there. Jeffy, I know you can reach up there. Oh, you're definitely high. You're so high, I think you can put the star on top of the tree. Jeffy, I can't. I need you to do it. You want another puff? Jeffy, put the star on top of the tree. Dang, I don't even understand why your star has to go on top of the tree. There's not stars on top of the trees outside. I know, but this is a Christmas tree. You're supposed to put a star on top. That's, that's the point of a Christmas tree. <sighs> All right, Daddy. Wherever you want. Give me a Here, look. Put it on there. I'm about to chuck this bitch. 
<laughs> you, know what, you, you know what? You know what, Jeffy? We don't even need to start on the top of the tree. You know what? That's what I've been trying to say the whole f***ing time, guys! Uh, Jeffy, stop cussing. Look, Santa Claus knows when you're cussing. When you're cussing, that means you're not gonna get presents. As long as you're a good boy and you don't cuss, Santa will come tonight with this big old bag of toys. And he'll deliver you all the expensive toys you want. Every single thing you want. As long as you're a good boy, Santa's gonna come inside the house with nobody guarding him. Just a big old bag of expensive toys. Literally anybody can rob him, but no one does because it's Santa Claus. And he's gonna come tonight. As long as you're a good boy. You got that? I want you to go to bed right now, Daddy! Yeah, let's go to bed. Let's get you ready for Christmas. Yay! All right, Jeffy, just go to sleep. Be a good boy and Santa Claus will come, all right? Um, Daddy, I got a question real quick. What? Um, if I shit my pants, does that count as being a good boy or a bad boy? That's a bad boy, Jeffy. Oh. Well, how does Santa Claus know if I shit my pants or not? He, he just knows those things, Jeffy. He, he's magical. He, uh, he has a, a tracker. Or... Jeffy, did you shit your pants? Oh, no. He's gonna have to stick his hand down my diaper and find out. But, Jeffy, your diaper's on the outside of your pants. Bingo, Daddy. See, you've done this before. This isn't your first rodeo. So why don't you put your cowboy hat and giddy on up out of here, Daddy? Oh, Jeffy, just, just go to sleep, all right? Santa only comes if you're sleeping. All right. <sighs> all right, so Jeffy's in bed. Now it's just time to go to sleep and wait for Santa Claus to come. Oh, is he gone? All right, Mario went to sleep. So I'm just gonna stay right here and wait for Santa Claus to come. And when he come out here, I'm gonna be knock him out and I'm gonna steal all his presents. But, but how am I gonna knock him out? Oh, I know. I'm gonna poison his milk with some Windex. And after he drinks it, it's gonna make his tummy really, really hurt. And then when he laying on the ground not feeling so good, I'm gonna steal all the presents and I'm gonna sell them on eBay. My first house. Let's get this over with. Stupid cop. Stupid ornaments. Stupid Christmas tree. Stupid Christmas. Let's get this over with. But, but first, let's see if they have my milk and cookies. <laughs> Whatever. I smell cookies! <laughs> Wait! I haven't had dinner yet! I'll save this for dessert! Let's see what they have! <laughs> yes! Hmm... Fruit Loops! That sounds good! Mmm... <laughs> mmm... I'm still pretty hungry! Hmm... Chef Boyardee! That sounds good to me. <laughs> yes. Mmm. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Time for some milk and cookies. It's time for dessert. Yes, my cookies. No. First of milk. Yes. Huh? What was that noise? Santa! Oh my god! Santa, are you okay? Mm, I'm tired. Wait, what? I'm tired. You, you what? I'm tired, dang it! Wait, you're dying? Yes, I've been poisoned. What, poisoned? It was the milk and cookies. What, the milk and cookies? The milk and cookies! Well, who poisoned the milk and cookies? It doesn't matter. Listen to me. I needed to deliver the presents to all the children around the world. Well, I can't do that. And this was my first house, so you got a long night ahead of you. Well, I can't do that, Sam. I don't have your magical powers. Sure you can. I believe in you. Santa, don't die. I'm dead. Santa, don't, don't die. Oh, no. He has no pulse. Santa, don't die. Don't die, Santa. Why do you smell like raviolis? Uh, oh, no. Oh, no. Who do I call? I can't call the cops. Dude, I think I killed Santa. Oh, what do I do? What do I do? Oh my 
go? What do I do? What do I do? Who do I call? I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. <laughs> All these presents, boy. <laughs> Black Yoshi, what are you doing? What's up, Bo? I'm just going through my presents. Those are not your presents, Black Yoshi. That's Santa's bag of gifts. But he gave them to me after I saw him choke on the cookies and die. Black Yoshi, did you poison the cookies and milk? Uh, maybe. Why would you do that, Black Yoshi? Because I really wanted some presents, and he wasn't going to be giving me any. So you poisoned Santa Claus so you can steal all the presents? Yeah. You know that means that no children on Earth is going to get gifts now? But now I get all the gifts. Black Yoshi, that's selfish. Look, he wants me to deliver all these gifts. How am I going to do that? Uh, I don't know. Fuck these are mine. Black Yoshi, no. Look, there's got to be like an emergency contact in here or something. Let's see. Um... Uh, oh, a paper. What's it say? It says, uh, if Santa dies, the only way to bring him back to life is to deliver all his remaining presents. You can teleport to other houses by grabbing his magical bag and saying, next house. All right, Black Yoshi, since you killed him, you're going to help me deliver all these presents. No, these presents is mine. Black Yoshi, no. You're going to help me deliver these presents since you killed Santa. Me. Okay. You dirty folks. Let's do this. Next, next house. house. All right, Black Yoshi, this is the first house. So let's just deliver the presents so we can leave, okay? All right, Bob, I think he's just right here. All right, put it under the tree. Black Yoshi, don't make noise. If they wake up, they're gonna call the cops. Well, he's already been delivered, folks, so let's go ahead and go. Well, Black Yoshi, no, they, they, they get more than one present. Well, how good do you think they was? But Black Yoshi, look, to bring Santa Claus back to life, we have to deliver all these presents. So that means every house has to get the presents they deserve. And obviously, they get more than one present. But we can just keep the rest for ourselves. No, Black Yoshi, look, look, to, to, to bring Santa Claus back to life, we have to deliver all these presents. <laughs> all right, folks, I got an idea. What? What, what? what are you doing? What are you, why, why'd you dump all the presents out? You said, the note said, that in order for Santa Claus to come back, all the presents have to be delivered. Well, they've been delivered, so now he can come back. You! You think you can poison me? What, Santa? I'm gonna kill you! Ah! Run like a bitch! Boy, boy, did wake up! What? Boy, did wake up! I think there's somebody in the house! Yeah, and there's an annoying bitch yelling in my ear. Which one do you think I'm more upset about? Boy, did I think it's Santa Claus! You should go check! Santa Claus. It's a robber. I know who it is. <gasps> I am not putting on my police outfit. But boy, do you look so sexy in your police officer outfit! I don't care if I look sexy, it's 3 a.m. and there's a robber in the house! But boy, do you look so sexy! Fine, fine, if it will shut you the hell up, I will put on my police outfit and I will go talk to this robber! Oh, oh Santa, are you okay? Santa, are you okay? Where is he? Where is he? I'm gonna kill him! What's up, fatty? Yeah! You're so dead! You think you can poison me? Oh, I'm out of here, folks! Oh, let's get out of here, Black Yoshi! Okay, look, I have the outfit on. You happy? Boiny, you need to straighten your tie. It's crooked! Well, I don't think the robber cares about my tie. Boiny, if we're having company, you need to straighten your tie. And tickles your head! You're indoors! What? It's part of the uniform. I thought you liked it. I like it when you get angry, Boiny. Look, we don't have time for this. There's a robber in the house. Oh, please! Look, I will, I will handcuff you to the bed as soon as I'm done with the robber, okay? Just stay here. I'm a cop! I'm a cop! He's so dead! Freeze! What are you doing in my house? What? Santa? Ho, ho, ho! Merry Christmas! What? Santa, what, what the hell happened to my tree? Oh, uh, I slipped on a banana peel. Suing me! On a banana peel? Yes! You eat a lot of bananas! But, no, no, no I don't. Oh. I guess I'll be going, Dad. No, 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 no. You, you, you're gonna stay here and you're gonna fix my f***ing tree. Uh, yeah, sure. Well, I'm pretty hungry. You got anything to eat? Oh, yeah, and I got, I got some Chef Boy ID. Chef Boy ID? <laughs> You, uh, you, you, you really like Chef Boyardee, huh? Yeah, I, I'm, I'm gonna go back to bed. You, you just keep doing your thing, okay? Boyardee, who was that? There was a lot of commotion. It was, it was Santa Claus. <gasps> Did you get his autograph, Boyardee? No, I didn't. Now, please, just let me sleep. Boyardee? Boyne, you said you were gonna handcuff me to the bed. I've been a bad girl. I know what I said, and I don't care. Just let me sleep. 
<laughs> well, that's just great, Black Yoshi. We almost got killed by the real Santa Claus because you killed Santa Claus to steal his presents. Before everything fine, he came back to life, everything good, and he's got his presents back. Well, Black Yoshi, we're not going to get any gifts from him for Christmas because you tried killing him and now he hates us and we're going to be lucky if we get any presents, Black Yoshi. Just, just go to sleep and don't steal anything ever again. Man, yeah, all right, <sighs> Christmas morning. Only one present, Daddy? Yeah, it looks like Santa only left one present. I mean, at least he left us something after what happened last night. Ooh, for me, I hope it's my chickens and my Kool-Aid. Better open it up, Mario, see what it is. Oh, let's see what it is. <sighs> yeah, yeah that's, that's expected. A picture of a finger? I always wanted a picture of a finger, Daddy. Man, he done burnt the chickens. That's, that's not chicken. You know what? Merry Christmas, guys, as long as we have each other, right? And maybe next year, Santa won't hate us. I'm happy with my finger. <laughs>